Inside Science TV. We all do it. But why do we itch? That's a really tough question. It's peak season for bug bites, poison ivy, and allergies. Just talking about it makes me itch. But don't. It turns out science supports what mom has said all along. The more you scratch, the more you itch. And the more you itch, the more you scratch. When you evoke the pain sensation, try to uh, suppress each sensation. Washington University's Center for the Study of Itch is a first of its kind in the U.S. Why is there an entire research center for itching? To understand and develop better treatments for serious itching conditions and learn more about how our skin, nerves, and immune systems work together. The researchers at the center found the pain of scratching and the sensation of itching go hand in hand, creating a vicious cycle. The definition of itch sums it up. An uncomfortable sensation that elicits a desire to scratch. A new study in mice showed scratching causes the brain to release serotonin, and that serotonin intensifies the itch sensation. So they scratch. Then the brain releases more serotonin, making them feel even more itchy. Researchers think this same pattern happens in humans. And worst of all, sometimes all you have to do is think about it. It's likely that just the thought of itching is one way uh, by which your central nervous system then triggers the sensation of itch. The one thing we do know? It's almost impossible to not scratch if, if you're itching. So true, but try not to. With the science behind the scratch, this is Inside Science TV. Inside Science TV. If you enjoyed this edition, follow us on the web and social media. Powered by the American Institute of Physics and a coalition of underwriters.